In this video, I use duct tape to draw lane lines and see how far I can push Tesla's basic autopilot. So I didn't start all the way over there. I want to start here just because I don't have much time and it takes a long time to like I'm duct taping these in with the papers that I have so it's a little bit thicker than the duct tape so Tesla can see it better I reduced the angle of the turn just a little bit so that uh, I wanted to start like small and then see how much the Tesla can turn right now it's turning into that fence and I'm gonna change it but this is ba this is basically what it looks like I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like from above so i put the lane lines as far apart from each other as possible but as uniform so that the tesla autopilot can see and this is how it turned out all right ready to go seeing the lanes autopilot on let's see Whoa, it seemed it's it saw the turning. It saw the turning, but it's still okay. I'm gonna still accelerate and see. Okay, that didn't work. So we'll go over that again and see if it does. Cause like Tesla could see the turn, but for some reason it didn't take the turning. So I'm gonna do it again and see what happens. Okay, autopilot. I'll choose the lowest speed just in case. it's turning see that the wheels are turning and it's trying to figure out where it's gonna go and now it lost it so it seems so it seems as though it's losing the autopilot here so I want to see what happens if I can like I can do it like a zigzag here in in this spot all right I'm gonna try this again and go at a super low speed and let's see what happens all right cruise control autopilot let's go at five you can see that the tesla can see that there's a turning but i don't know why it's not taking the turning okay it looks like it's about to take the turning and then it's thinking of going straight that doesn't make any sense all right so that was a total fail so what i'm gonna do is I'm gonna start turning from here and I'm gonna move some of these lines and I'm gonna start turning from here and that's too wide that I can see like this is for like two lanes like usually turnings like this are um, a little bit narrow but this this is too wide so I'm gonna get uh, make it a narrow turning and I'm gonna start the turning from here so that the, like the Tesla wheel doesn't have to really turn that much because Tesla can see that there's a turning but it's not taking that turning for some reason so I'm gonna try and figure that out and I'll have to take all of these out again it's so much work and it takes so much time all right I'm out of breath but this is what the new turning looks like it's a little bit the angle is a little bit less than what we had before it starts turning from over here and then it's just a normal turning let's see if tesla can make this one all right seat belts on we're ready to take this turning that i made with duct tape so i'm gonna go as slow as possible to see what the Tesla does so put it into five and let's see what it does all right it sees the line better now it sees that there's a turning coming up okay come on come on come on all right all right it's turning it's turning it's turning it can see the lines ah come on all right I'm just still gonna keep on going
So it looks like we did pretty well. Uh, Tesla took the turning and kind of did pretty well. I'm going to go again and see what happens. Come on. Oh, okay. So it looks like I can't use autopilot anymore because it says whole steering wheel warning has been ignored. So I put uh, I pushed the get, uh, accelerator even when I was like even it even when it wanted my attention and wanted me to take control. So Tesla's mad at me. It's putting me in Tesla jail. So what I gotta do is I put, gotta put it in park and then I gotta put it in drive again and that's when autopilot would be avail available again. So right now it's the car's not moving, so it's not available. I'm gonna I'm just gonna reverse. And look at that, you regenerate battery even when you're like going reverse. Alright, so autopilot's active, put it in park and so I'll reset it. Autopilot. This time I'm gonna go 10 and let's see what happens. So you can see the turning, so that's the that's the main thing. It can see the turning, but it's still not making the turn. So I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna edit this again. Uh, I'm gonna put in more lane lines. Uh, let's see if more lane lines help. All right, more work. So I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make the turning a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna reduce the angle again. Uh, I've seen Tesla turn up till here and I only have basic autopilot. Okay, that's my drone. I'm gonna have to get it down. Right, so now we got a kind of an angled attack. I put, I did, a little, I did a little bit of curve here, so it's gonna turn left a little bit, and then it's gonna attack that turning. So let's see if Tesla can do this one. All right, it's getting dark. I have a different form of attack right now, so it's gonna turn left a little bit. And if you can, if you guys can see here, I'll just pull it up when I'm editing it. But basically it's a slight left and then a right turning. The Tesla should be able to make this one. So let's see. I'm super excited for this one because this one's super different than the rest. This one should work. But there seems like Tesla thinks there's like there's like a stop, uh, stop sign here. So maybe that's why or like Tesla knows that you have to stop and yield there. And right, take it above. Perfect bird's eye view. All right, ready. Let's see how the Tesla does here. All right, autopilot is on. Ooh, it, it, it is still making that turning. Let's see what it does. All right, now that was interesting. Let's do it again. <laughs> All right, I forgot to turn this camera on when I was doing 
the lane line so like you guys could see better how the Tesla was doing so I'll keep this on this time and do the exact same thing again because I don't think I have time to uh, remake the lane lines again uh, the sun's about to set and it's gonna get dark and I'll have to get my drone down too uh, just because the DJI doesn't really work at night so turn. thankfully like I chose like a Sunday evening to do this and no one is here uh, just a few people here and there like there's this person just randomly walking out of the woods and yeah he's not coming to the parking lot so that's good so I'm gonna try this again and see how this works um, I have my lane lines over here and I'm gonna start it from here and give you guys a basic idea of how the how it works all right autopilot on Let's see how it does in 15. All right. Oh, it looks like the faster it goes, the better it does. Okay, so now it lost control. And right now I'm just gonna keep on going and see how far it goes. Okay, that's not where it's supposed to go. So we're done and now starts the hardest part of the day where I gotta take all of these off. You can see that the sun's setting. Oh wow, look at that, so beautiful. So it took me a lot of physical work, it was hard. Uh, I've been here for almost two hours just doing this and making this video for you guys. I hope hopefully you guys liked it if you guys liked it please smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm and if you're new to the channel please subscribe to Tesla peg and hit that bell notification button for future updates have a wonderful rest of the day good night